Welcome back to my trip to Georgia. We'll get straight into it and pick up where we left off last time, in the city of Borjomi. Where are we, Sally? We're in Borjomi. <laughs> After a nice sleep in this lovely guest house, we went out to explore the city and its naturally carbonated water. Where are we now, Sally? Borjomi Central Historical Park, where all the sour waters are. And of course we all had to taste the special sour water. It's warm, naturally, and fizzy, and quite disgusting. <laughs> Try some. Okay. As you can tell from our faces, the water was, as promised, quite disgusting. And yet, for some reason, we all kept drinking it and we finished the bottle. That's all the minerals reacting to oxygen. Because it's full of iron and calcium and whatever, and when it's exposed to oxygen. <laughs> cool, wow. We continued to explore the park, which had so many fun surprises. We really embraced our inner child for a bit, and we had so much fun as adults, so I can't even imagine how fun it would be as a child. So I told myself, I'm gonna bring my future kids here someday. Now, imagine if I actually have kids, and I actually bring them here, and then I show them this video. That'd be cool. Hi! Hi! <laughs> Who is that? Is that you? That is Promete! Oh! Uh, this guy used to stand somewhere in Tbilisi and then for some reason, because someone wanted so, they just took him here and put him here. Huh. So that's actually Harry Potter holding his snake. <laughs> just grown and has had laser surgery on his eyes. We kept strolling around and enjoying the beauty of the park as well as the absolute hilarity of this stick in the water. But mostly the beauty, of course. Oh, that is so cute. Are they lovers or mother and daughter? <laughs> Where are we now? We are still in Borjomi. We're gonna eat some good food and then we're gonna go live. To the glammy spot. After some delicious food, we continued again on our road trip. We said goodbye to the colorful buildings and hello to the sunset along the road. Eventually, we got to Chiatura and picked up some groceries before heading to <coughs> Katri. What is it? When the sun is up, we'll see. So there's a church on this hill? Yes. Cool. He's recording all the pieces, have <laughs> <laughs> Ew. We were staying in a house that's basically designated for people who want to climb in the area and there were actually two other guys staying there at the time we were. We chilled a bit and we went to sleep. I was woken up from a rough sleep by one of the other people in the house playing Kylie Minogue's I Can't Get You Out of My Head. Not the worst alarm clock. Then Sally made some delicious fruit bowls for breakfast. So Sally, what are you doing? I'm making the fruit bowls for everybody. Mm. Except for the two boys that we don't like. <laughs> <laughs> After that, we headed out to see the church on the hill that we'd seen in the dark yesterday. And what a lovely route we took. Full of calves and daisies. You like foreign hands? Mm -hmm. She's curious. Wedi, wedi. 
valley. This is so nice with the flowers. <laughs> we walked through a flower field where Sally had plenty of opportunities to test Arachne's love for her. You know, the whole, he loves me, he loves me not, that sort of thing. And well, it didn't go so well. I Shut this up checked. your ass! <laughs> <laughs> already checked. <laughs> You're lying when you poop. So, as you can see, this path was like a dream. Something from a film. A slice of heaven, even. Well, it didn't last. The path got narrower and steeper, and soon we were on a very thin trail with a very steep drop right beside it. Now, I can see from the videos that it doesn't look that bad, but trust me, one wrong foot and I would have died. Last time we were here, there was a huge um, wasp nest, oh. like over there, and there was a cloud of them. We were walking along there, and then it went soup soup, and it was very scary. But then the path went back to Studio Ghibli vibes, and I was very happy. The church on the hill was absolutely magnificent. We couldn't actually go up to the top, but there was another church at the bottom where we could admire the artwork. We continued on to go to a swimming spot, which required another scary trail, but it was totally worth it. Going on another scary trail. Je t'emmène faire le tour de ma grande ville. Je te verrai tous les jours. Si je te pose des questions, qu'est-ce que tu diras? The water was freezing, but after walking for ages in the heat, we were all very happy to jump in. <laughs> what? During, during the funeral. <laughs> during the funeral. Yes, in the process. Should we get drunk? Yeah, you know, I'll be laughing. Should, should I be named your wife after you die? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, declare myself a widow. Oh no! And now it's time for the grand tour of the shack. Here we have the office. Here's the washroom. Here's my own private bedroom. Yeah, you heard me. Here's the other bedroom, the kitchen, and the living room. The two other guests included an artist who I didn't already get a chance to talk to, and a very interesting guy who had hitchhiked through China and India, and who was a big fan of James Joyce and the IRA. This is corn flour, and I'm making cheese pancakes with it. <gasps> Cheese pancakes. Kind of, yeah. Cool. I don't know how else to describe it. Mm. I'm making baby tristari. I'm <laughs> making what? It's called tristari if it has cheese in it. If, mm. uh, oh shit. <laughs> if you put cheese, if you put cheese on top of it later after it's cooked, that's some jelly. So if mm. it's clean. Okay. Alright, what do you do now? 
I'm making the very boring but very delicious Georgian cucumber tomato salad. After this delicious meal, we headed at long last to the climbing spot. Tonight, I'm gonna have myself a We're doing great. What, what are we doing? Oh, <laughs> we are climbing. Yay, climbing this thing. So first, Arachne, the expert, climbed up without the rope, which I could barely watch, to fasten the rope for us. Then it was my turn to climb. Now, as you can see, I'm a beginner, but luckily I had Sally as my cheerleader and Arachne as my coach. No, yeah, no, just yeah. stand stand on your feet. Cool, cool, that's it. That's the whole logic of climbing, nothing more. Put your feet and, uh. and just stand up. I'm actually very proud of how high I went, but unfortunately my camera died. So I only had this terrible phone footage from when I went to the top. Granny, I look at that. Good job! Good job! Wow! See, someone's cheering for you. <laughs> Keep climbing. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm satisfied and proud of myself. So, can I sit? Um, you sit, yeah. Okay, but can I sit for a second? Yes, of course. Then it was Sally's turn, and of course she did an amazing job. She was doing so well that Arachne decided to let himself fall off the cliff so that Sally could practice her belaying skills. As we were finishing up, it started to storm, which was so cool. And it was very important for me to get a good video of the lightning. And I think I succeeded. Come on. Oh, that was a good one. Nice. Mm. Fuck yeah. And that's a wrap for the next three days of my George trip. But don't worry, there's still more to come. The next video will be way more random and unorganized because I got very lazy and also lost some footage. So feel free to lower your expectations for the next one. See you then!